So the very first step in any workflow, you want to hit what we call a trigger node. So a trigger node is a trigger event that will kickstart your entire workflow. So in this case, what I want to do is introduce the first trigger node. And how I would do that is to hit the plus sign here in the middle. You can also do the same thing with a plus sign here on the top right hand corner. But I'm going to hit the one here in the middle. And as you can see, there's a list of choices of trigger nodes that you can pick from. So in this case, I'm going to just choose a chat trigger node. So literally, I'm typing in chat. So hit chat trigger node. This is going to be the trigger node that I want to select. Now you have to define then when this trigger happens, what happens to the next node. In this case, this is a chat message received. So which means you can actually pull out from the bottom bar here, the chat section. And once you hit it, it'll come up and you can actually populate this node with a value. So in this case, because this workflow is going to generate videos for me with Sora 2 or VO 3.1, what I want to fill in is a very specific prompt. So in this case, create an eight second cinematic, create an eight second cinematic marketing video for a small local coffee shop called Bean Haven. Show a beautiful close up of fresh coffee beans being grounded. Da, da, da. So this is just describing the scene that we want Sora 2 or VO 3.1 to generate. I'm going to just hit enter or rather the arrow button there. So this is going to populate the node with the input, right? So the chat input is basically what I've just typed in to the chat. So this will then get passed on to the second node. 